Hello again, this is What's Up, and this is pulsing a yoke coil 6. Uh, in the last video, I pulsed uh, these two primaries, the yellows and the greens, and I had my uh, output on the uh, secondary after the bifiller with the bifiller in between. Something very curious though, when you put this here in the middle, that means something of an analog to uh, 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 T1000's uh, 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 Cadacious coil, uh, where the output is uh, coming from one end and the middle. So let's just uh, do a quick, uh, quick scan down on the uh, coil of 15 turns. Okay, we can show a little bit of output here at 8.25 megahertz. There's a burst there at uh, 5.65 megahertz. And keep going down. Now look at this, starting at around 340. Let's go up to uh, let's go up to 400. Let's say from 400, we are at 5.37 volts DC. And as we're shooting down, we're now up to 7.8 volts DC. Let me put the uh, this thing here at 1 volt. Bring the... This is the waveform. So 78 kilohertz. 7.78 volts coming out, 7.9, then it's starting to go down again. So, 7.9, 76 kilohertz on the 15 turns. And as we go down, things will start breaking down and... Uh, the output will start going down, but it's pretty it's pretty incredible that all through this whole frequency range we're getting output here on that uh, 15 turns and uh, So this is much higher voltage output when we're only taking the center tap of the bifiller 9 Hertz we could see a little bit of flickering, but not much so I'm just wondering here if this 15 turn coil is going to be receiving 50 Hertz there's not much effect happening at 50 Hertz on this thing not as much as if you put the 50 Hertz on the 50 turn coil so let's just change this around let's put this uh, onto the coil of 50 turns and here's where some of the fun starts well we can see that the 50 Hertz is a lot brighter you can see it even flickering a lot better than if I put it at the end here on the output. Well, almost. But this is where the fun really starts. Let's bring it up. Okay, here's where we're starting to go up at about 340 hertz. At 5.75 we're going up. We are now at 5 kilohertz. We are now at 8.22 volts DC. Let's see if we can go any higher. We're now in the 9, nine volts. Let me just get this here. I'm 1.5 volts away from my uh, special point. We're at 25.8 kilohertz range, which is giving me the best output on this secondary from the coil of 50 turns. Uh, and if I put this on the end here, 8.17. So we're getting more voltage out when we're just taking off the center. Seems as though this by filler is creating a type of uh, uh, choke effect 
on the output. Maybe that's uh, a type of accumulator type effect. I don't know exactly. So uh, we're going to start testing uh, the other variables in the next video. Okay. Thank you and have a good day.